Okay, after endless and endless tutorials, I think we can finally go inside the house now. So let's go. All right, so I think we're going to do the kitchen first. Because that's usually the most expensive part. So. Sims gotta eat. Yes, I think <laughs> let's go with the... Uh, we have not very much money left, so... Can you do like um, like a general plop in a general kitchen outline, or do you need to actually do it piece by piece? You can, I think, do one like that. You can build. Yeah, it's pretty interesting. I've never done that. I'm not sure how I feel about that. You can try. Let's see what it does. Okay. We can, wait, wait, we can delete it after, right? I don't know. <laughs> well, that's, let's, let's, not, let's not buy the baller kitchen. That's uh, baseline kitchen. Baseline I don't kitchen. I like that one. I feel like it's going to do the floors, too. You don't like linoleum? No. No. Okay, well, let's, like, well, let's see if we can undo it. Well, let's see. Buy what you like, and then maybe we can delete the floor and change it, and we'll get some money back. Like, you just didn't like that kitchen because it has, like, a weird floor, right? Whoa. Oh, I see. So, got a rotator. Try double clicking. There you go. <laughs> there it is. Because that <laughs> totally makes sense. That's exactly where I want my kitchen. Why huh. is it installing a door? <laughs> I don't know. You're the Sims expert. I don't know these things you ask. Okay, wait, how about... Very interesting. Okay, how, okay let's, just build, interesting. let's just build our own kitchen. You can delete it. <laughs> well, it is really cool. What is this? Whoa! That is cool. We added extra levels to our house magically. New... Magic. Okay, well, it's interesting. Let's unpurchase that. I guess if you just want, like, a really easy, quick and, quick and dirty... That's yeah, a pretty good option. Okay, so I'm gonna try and uh, let's pick our fridge first. We'll do a fridge that's like mid range. So I feel like a fridge, bed, toilet, shower is like where you wanna spend. Um, like you don't wanna cheap out. Cheap out. So just put a fridge here. So what? Mm -hmm. what what's the benefit of buying like? A really expensive fridge. Well, if I if I spent like fourteen grand on that really ball of fridge, that's more than our house. Let's <laughs> see. Well, the food quality is the best that it can possibly be, and it's unbreakable. So something that's really fresh, well, kind of annoying in The Sims is that items break, especially sinks and toilets and showers, and you either have to call someone to repair it, or if you're really your Sim is handy, then you can repair it yourself. Um, basically the benefit is the food quality, which I'm guessing um, in this Sims will probably mean that it fills your Sim up quicker, so you have to feed, less, feed them less often, or they just, it makes them happier. It increases their mood. $12,000 house, $14,000 so, fridge. <laughs> <laughs> one day, we'll get a job and then we can afford it. How's that sound? We can't live on, off the government? That will be our ambition. Uh, <laughs> Okay, so let's move the fridge over, and we want a few counters. I'm thinking we're going to do an island, um, so that, I don't know if we have room for a table. I guess we kind of do. Um, that's Good, like, we, like one of like a, like a bar table. Like an L shape? Oh, I see. Sort of, do you know what I mean? Yeah, okay. But we don't have to, we can put a table. Let's just do a table, I think that'll be easier. How about we build the table first and they'll kind of give us our outline of where we can build our counters. Okay, um, so that would be dining room. Oh, that's cool. It includes the bar option in here. I really like the layout of this. This is nice and easy to see what you're choosing. Um, I don't think we have enough space or money for a bar. <laughs> so no. let's, let's just get a dining room table. No, but look at all the options. Can we like, let's just say, so many options. we get more money, can we make our house bigger? Right? Yeah, you can build walls, you can, um, it depends how big our lot is, like our lot isn't very big. You can build up, you can build floors. Oh, okay. Um, 
it's too like our yard is fairly small, so we can't I'm trying to see where we are. We're right next to the railroad tracks. That's probably why it was so cheap. <laughs> you can, like fall into the lake here. We're budget. We are budget. Okay. Simming here. Look at all the tables. Oh, so many new options. Okay, I like this one, but it's kind of expensive. Oh well. <laughs> <laughs> why do we need a six-person table or by ourselves? Well, because you have people over and you have parties. Okay. Oh, Nick, so silly. So silly. Okay, we'll put it here. That's nice. Very pretty. There are different colors too. Okay, we'll stick with that one. And let's do our chairs. So we have the most expensive chair, it looks like it's $900, which is slightly different from Sims 3. They had way more expensive chairs than that. And we have comfort levels. So let's choose one that's slightly comfortable, but not really expensive. I like the pink chair. That is nice. And look at all the color options. Let's go with the dark purple. Alright. That's easy. And... Just checking them out. It's new. It's kind of nice. Okay, so let's choose a lamp. What kind of lamps do you like? <laughs> oh, Please. that's kind of cool. I like that. Do they have any other candles? It's like movie light. Wait, can't you start fires in The Sims? Yeah, but not with a light. I don't but wow. you're, you're putting candles down. I don't know. I've never had a problem with a candle lighting a fire <laughs> in my Sims game, but I guess it's possible. Like, this could be different. Um, <laughs> this is cool. Wait, why is it? No. This one. This one. Oh, it's not unlocked yet. I see. We need to be level two. We gotta level up. That's really neat. I like how you can unlock things with um, your achievements. That's different. And I like it. What is this? Ooh. Ah. Uh, look at that fanciness. Okay. There's so many lamps. So many. How do we choose? Return to desk light. We want like a hanging one. Maybe this one? This looks like something you get at Home Depot. Mm hmm. <laughs> it's okay. We're, we live right beside the train tracks, so I don't think we're allowed to be picky here. <laughs> yeah, how's that? Like it? All yes, right. go. Light. More and light. we have light. We need more light. I think we actually might. I'm gonna take a quick detour for a second. So the reason why our house is so dark and this is one of the first things I do when I buy a house is I put in more windows because there's never enough windows and it actually makes your house so dark um, that it can be hard to see. So if we add a few more windows, I don't know what kind of windows these are. Whoa. Whoa. Um, kind of want ones that are almost the same. So let's see if we can find... It's not that one, is it? It is. So I'll add a few more windows just so that it's a lot lighter <laughs> into the bedroom. My OCD, OCD telling me that it's window, higher. It's higher than the other yeah, one. Yeah, it is. Why are these <laughs> low? I can change that. I can change. We'll make them all higher. Yeah. Does that make you happy? Well, no, yeah. that window's not centered. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> So it made it a little brighter, but not a huge difference, did it? Actually, actually did it's a little good. better. A little better. The bathroom's super dark, so I'll just quickly add a few more windows so that when we're putting stuff in the rooms that we can, it's a little easier to see. We can put a bigger window there. Do I have a bay window? Ooh, we're getting pricey now. That's not that much. Oh, it's pretty. Do we like it? Yes. Yeah? Let's do it. Okay, and then we'll add one more window, and then we'll go back to the kitchen. We'll go... Don't worry, I'll change the position of that. What the heck? Okay. Can we just put instead two small windows beside you, like can we just do one big window? Yeah, but this leaves us an option if we want to put something on the wall here. That's the only reason I was not doing that. Thinking. Thinking ahead. Yeah. 
Th that bay, this, sh this front area should be a bay window too, shouldn't it? It should. Can we fit one in there like that? Can we, we get shall. money for these? Yes, we wait. Yeah, 35 bucks, I think. Yes. Okay. We'll try it. Double bay windows. Nice. We did this one before, right? Oh, no, we can't. No! <gasps> That's just silly. Isn't that silly? Lame. That is really lame, actually. <sighs> Boo. Yeah. I feel like my windows might be slightly on the high side, but... It's okay, We it's a quick adjust. Should we just... Then I don't want to change all the windows in the house. <laughs> Alright, we'll do it real quick. To the same height, because I know it's going to bother you if they're not the same height. Yes, it will. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, we'll move this one up too so that it's, and it's centered as possible. We have crooked wall... well, not equidistant walls. Yeah, it's alright. You won't notice the windows once we're in uh, play mode. These are all the, these are the same height, are they? It's our starter home. What the frig? You see that? Okay. Okay. That's good. All right. So let's go back to furnishes. I think we'll add one more light so that it's not super dark in here. We'll add it here. And let's add a light since we're in here. Let's add lights for other things. Let's add a light. In here, just add it in there. We want a bedroom light. So maybe our bedroom lights can be uh, a table lights. Never have too many lights. Retro. So retro. What's this? Ooh. The options are endless. Put this one in here too, and we'll put one in here. I actually don't mind the wallpaper in there. We might not have to change it. Okay, so we've got um, our table in. Oh, miscellaneous decorations. Did I finish the baseline first? Oh, this is so exciting. We'll get it. Finish the baseline kitchen we have first. Have a coffee mug rack. <laughs> Wait, no, because what if we want to put in a dining hutch? It can, we can happen. can afford nice things. How can we get? The problem is like we might not realize this until we have people in our house. If I put that there, we could realize that people might not be able to get into the other chairs, which is kind of a silly aspect of The Sims, but it's something that you kind of figure out once you have people in. So we'll not buy that right now. So let's go back to our counters, our kitchen. I need to reset the color. And that is not correct. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Let's undo that. All right. We're good now. Let's see how it auto does it. We forgot our oven. We may have to move that. You don't want to cheap out on the oven, right? No. It can um, break and cause fires. <laughs> so we can't afford a three thousand dollar one. So we'll buy this one. That's not okay. Is that okay? Okay. We'll have to. Where's our sink gonna go? Increase here. Okay. Um, we want to go. See, I'm not familiar with if a hood is necessary because I don't think it is. But hoods were not in the previous Sims, so... They must do something. They might do something, they might just be decorative, I have no idea. Let's get a cheap one. I kind of like this one, though. The house will be smelly. Yeah! Right there. These are really cool, though. Look at that. What the heck? What is that? I guess it would be like if you had an island, they're ones that um, go from the ceiling. Oh. Uh... But we're not baller enough to afford an island right now. So let's just get a sink. These are really <laughs> cool. I like this. We could actually double task for our bathroom right now if we wanted. Because these sinks are here. How's that? It really depends on how the sh where the yeah, shower and the toilet's going to go. Yeah, you're right. Let's do it later. Okay. We'll buy reliability. Sinks break all the time. Let's just get a simple sink. Put it there. Um, I can't understand why there is not a dishwasher. I guess this one doesn't have 
dishwasher? Do you want to buy a twelve hundred dollar trash can? No. <laughs> <laughs> I think I would like a bed no. first. <laughs> no, thank you. You want a bed first? Yes. So picky. Okay, we need to put Not in picky. the fire alarm because that is always so important and we want... What is that? So if there's a fire, we pull oh. that? Oh. Sprinklers require a ceiling. I've never... They've never had that before. That's really cool. Does it deploy sprinklers already or do you have to install them? I think that's too fancy. We might install that later. If you put that fire alarm right beside the oven, is it going to be constantly going off? No, it only if the uh, fire goes off. Okay. So, I don't really think we need a microwave, but just to kind of show everyone the options. Looks like we have coffee makers, which is pretty neat. There's that thing on the far right. <laughs> Whoa! $2,100! Cupcake factory! We can fit it in our living room. Do we want it? Because <laughs> I kind of want it. Charlie the Chocolate Factory we'll, style. We'll put it on the most, like, we want it. It's the list of stuff that we want. Okay. <laughs> we want that, eventually. I like this. Can we fit these? Uppers? Yeah. Yeah, uppers. Well, not on top of the fridge, because, well, I guess we could do it. <laughs> well, I don't know. Kind of blocks windows, doesn't it? Does that look silly? Will the storage come into a play at all? No, it's just aesthetic. Oh, I see. It's just the wants, the wants versus that I, the needs. The want that I want, yeah. Okay, so now we can decorate our counters because I like doing this. We have our garbage cans. I I think a microwave is essential. Is it? Yes. I don't really use microwaves. We can put one in and see what it does. I think they had microwaves before, but just put it there. Good spot. All right, we don't really need a coffee maker. I don't think. Coffee is life. What are if you talking? If you were ever really tired, you could put, um, you could drink coffee, but then it made you always have to pee, constantly, like peeing constantly. <laughs> the uh, the sacrifice is well worth it. Oh, I love the decoration things. Um, paper towel dispenser. Let's get that. A Mary milkmaid. Let's see what it looks like. Cool. Crates. Oh, I like that. I find it kind of weird that our, our end of our kitchen kind of just stops at the stove. Should we switch it? Well, maybe... I, I agree. Maybe just put like another end there or move the stove to the inside. I don't know. It just it feels weird. Yeah, I agree. Well, why don't we put the garbage can... I don't like how the garbage can is not laying flush against the wall. Like, why is it not letting me do that? See what I mean? Yeah, I know. Weird. Weird. Let's put it in the middle of the kitchen, shall we? It needs to be near the kitchen. I think if I put it there, it might be... I'll just put it there. How's that? Okay. Uh, I, I agree with the counter problemo. It needs to be changed. Better? I like that. Okay. Yeah? That makes more sense. <laughs> I agree. Back to decorations, which are so much fun. Elemental display rack. Oh my goodness. That is really cool. Let's get a bowl of fruit. These are all new. I like. Let's zoom in. Those graphics. So well, you were playing. Well, you were playing on a MacBook before. So. I was. Cause I, that's all I had. Condiment basket. Oh my gosh. So many options. I can't believe it. Using a GTX 90. I am thoroughly Play. pleased right now with all of these options. Play Sims 4. Screen of oh, secrets. I want this. Maybe next time. Concept coffee racks. 270 bucks. We need to reel reel back in. We have four thousand dollars and we still have we don't, to. We don't we we still have I a know, bathroom I and a, a bedroom to make here. That's not, we don't a living room's kind of a luxury, but we kinda need a bathroom uh, in the <laughs> Okay, let's get some plants and then we'll move on. Oh my gosh, look at all the plants. This is a lot of option. These are really expensive. Kind of forgot about our budget and now it's just spending. Spending. It's spending, okay. Spending. It's alright. Well, if, if it comes down to it, we can get a quick visit from the Rico man. And... I don't like that. <laughs> so sad. 
Oh, they're so pretty. Okay. Orchid, you not pot. What? Pretty. Look at all the plant options. Just hang. Ooh, that's nice. Do we like that inside? <laughs> inside our house? Do we want? I want a bed. Flowers. I want to be able to afford a bed. Oh, the difference between men and women. I want flowers. That's what I want. I want to put. Do they have any big ones? Okay. I promise you I'm almost done. Alright, let's move on to our bedroom. It's, I like that they actually used to do a bathroom because it's next on here. I think we should just, uh, fi we'll finish off with this last bathroom and then we'll call it a first episode. We're going to pick up from there next time. Okay, so let's get the shower. And we have hygiene relief, stress relief discomfort. It's a $2,100 shower. We need something. So basically the hygiene scale, it, I don't know if it'll just, if it's less time in the shower or if your hygiene just stays longer. I'm not 100% sure. Let's just get a simple, let's just get this one. We have limited room in this teeny tiny We do, bathroom. so we'll get a tiny shower. We'll put it here and then let's get a toilet. It's our most expensive toilet. Sweet escapes. Whoa, that Atlantis thing looked cool. Isn't that really cool? That's like Euro style. I know. Let's get it. No, we can't afford it. I don't want to get the cheapest one though. Okay. We put the toilet in here. We need to put it in a place where we can still. Okay. Put it there. Get a sink. Okay. Can we still get in the shower? Yes. I think. Yes. No, it's front facing. You see the handle on the yeah. front. Yeah. Okay, good. So what other options do we have? We have accents. I want to put in a... You know, it's kind of tight in there. But let's just put in a towel rack. Bath caddy. That's neat. A lot of options. So there's tub options as well. There's a lot of tub options. Three thousand dollar tub. Whoa, twelve thousand dollars. <gasps> oh, the luxury. Let's put in a little light scone. Pretty. I'm gonna put in a rug. <laughs> Dinosaur. Dinosaur rug in the living room. Okay, let's go on to our next room. Actually, I want to put in a plant. So the reasons why you wait, these plants don't have. Okay, so some of them do. Um, some of the reasons why you would put in a plant sometimes is if they increase your environment. So if you put a sim into an ugly house, it can actually affect their mood and they'll complain about it and they won't like it. So that's one reason to put in plants um, other than them just being decorative. But if it does improve something, it'll tell you like environment one or two. Or... Okay. Okay. So let's get our bedroom. Um bed is important and the reason why you would maybe spend more money on a bed is because um quality of sleep it's the quality of your sleep and you'll be able to get the full energy bar refreshed um in less time okay but i think we'll, we'll call it a session there and then we'll pick up exactly where we left off last time the character creation took a while and yeah we spent a lot of time in the kitchen <laughs> That's the fun part but look how beautiful it is now yeah it's pretty good start it's pretty I think, yeah we'll call it first episode uh ho thank you guys for watching thank you i uh, hopefully get you guys enjoyed if you want to see more let us know in the comment box below drop the video a quick like and we'll both see you guys next time for some more sins for all right bye bye